Hi guys, quick tutorial here to show you how you can spawn a random actor just by using one actor alone. Um, first of all, you see I wanted to spawn these ghosts, all these different coloured ghosts here. I've got seven altogether. Um, ignore these ones here. The ghost kill, that's just a special effect I'm using for when you actually kill the ghosts. But the main thing here is I've got seven ghosts. Ghost, ghost two, ghost three, ghost four. And I wanted to be able to just use one actor to spawn um, a random coloured ghost. It's possibly a better way to do this. Um, but I've made two attributes here, two integers, a choose and a spawn time. The reason I've added an integer called spawn time is set to five, that's five seconds, is because when the game gets harder, say you get a score over ten, you can change the spawn time down to a lesser number to make the ghost spawn quicker. <clears throat> so after you've done that, you need to make um, an actor there, which mine's just called spawner back. Ignore the sound play there. This is the one we're interested in, the timer. Um, every spawn time, remember the spawn time attribute was set to five seconds. I've done a game choose, which is the other integer we set there. Random number one to seven. So it's going to pick a number every five seconds. It's going to pick a number from one to seven. And if it picks number one, we're going to spawn the ghost. If it picks number two, we're going to spawn a ghost two, and so on and so on. So just let's see this in action. <clears throat> this is a game I'm working on at the moment. All the artwork I've done myself. Um, just turn the sound down a little bit. Obviously the artwork will change when I uh, get my artist on board. But you can see that actor there, single actor spawning all these different ghosts at random positions. Obviously I've set the Y to the bottom of the screen and the X to a random position for the width of the screen. But every five seconds you'll see a ghost appearing. And that's pretty much it guys. Um, I hope it's useful. Might be a better way to do it if you want to use the same actor like with the images instead of the um, of making seven different ghosts, I'm sure there is. Um, but it's probably going to be useful if you've got seven different actor types. So this is Darren, I'm going to sign off now. Hope you enjoyed that.